Cool. Last story. Dramatic video shows skier. Oh, you love this. I watched the video already. Okay. Yeah. Because uh, you sent the link to the video. And you're big on the snowboarding. I couldn't remember if it was yeah, skiing. Get it right, bud. <laughs> I, I wonder, I was thinking about this when I watched this video. This is a crazy video of a rescue. And it was all so like spontaneous. Perf like perfect timing. It was just, it's just, it's just like you, you just, there are these moments captured sometimes where you, you just can't believe that the series of events happened the way that they did. You just, it's just yeah. too am amazing and incredible. But anyway, you have this one, I'll set it up for you. You have a guy who's just recording on a GoPro and he's in the back country over there and he's just going through some trees, very deep powder. Do I do a play by play kind of situation? We can do play by play. And I mean, it's just be beautiful. Uh, I think you're too far ahead, though, because I, I want to see when he comes past. You got to back up a little bit. So he's skiing through, and he has uh, somebody he's skiing with, one other partner, who's just a little bit ahead there. And he's not flying or anything. He comes through, jumps through this section, lands in this deep snow here, but lands upright, and he's like, oh, man, and it's some deep, deep snow. snow here. Heavy, deep and it's all these trees, so they have these tree wells where snow piles up even deeper in and around the tree. So he catches him, he keeps going, he's like, oh my god. You and right? he realizes at this moment that somebody's trapped there, and it's not from his party. It's a snowboard, it's not skis, first of all. And he starts scrambling. He starts moving quickly towards this individual because what you end up noticing is the only thing poking out of the snow is just the snowboard itself. Like part of the snowboard, yeah. And the person is completely buried. Upside and, down. And uh, incapable of movement, incapable of budging. They've gone so deep down here. And this guy struggles to get to him. Yeah, the snow He's is just so like deep. five feet away. And he uses his skis. And he knows it's a race against time. This guy, this snowboarder is upside down in the snow. Can I just ask him, can you pause for a second here? Is it more dangerous to be going through this terrain on a snowboard than skis? Hmm. It's got to be, right? Because you can't easily get out of it. Yeah, in the fact that your feet are tied to one board. Yeah. Yeah. I would say so. I mean, not, not to say that you can't die in either one in a given scenario, but just the way this guy's trapped, it's like the board is kind of taking away his ability to contort his body into escaping yeah. the pile at all. For sure, yeah. With skis, at least you can, like, bend, and it's like... They're I mean, split. Two, I don't know. Yeah. Maybe it can increase your chances, and or maybe they pop off or whatever. But anyway, sure. okay, so now he's approaching. He's using his skis to climb up there. Come on. And the breathing on the GoPro and the footage, the incredible footage. Fucking goddammit. Hold on, I'm coming. Dude, this guy is literally buried in snow. And what happened was the snowboarder, like, um, snowboarded and then just fell, but the snow behind him, like, just rolled over him like a mini avalanche. Yeah. And it's deeper in right by the t tree trunk. Look how close he is to the, to the tree trunk there. Yeah. And look how deep hey, he has to can dig. You hear me? Can you hear me? <sighs> Terrifying. Uh, Terrifying. Sees his arm. An arm starts moving, but like, where's the face? Where's the head? How long can you get air in there? Look how packed it is. This guy's gonna die. He was gonna die. Yeah. That's it. Like, he was gonna die. They said like a minute, a minute after, he would have been gone. So much snow and still oh. looking oh, for his head. He said, did he say, help me out? You see the okay. goggles there? You all right? Okay, you're good. You're good, I got you. You okay? Can you breathe? Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. Unbelievable. Crap. Gonna, 
crazy, crazy clip. Oh, All the, the comments are like, this is like legit hero yeah, stuff. Like you actually yeah. just saved this guy's life. Oh, yeah, yeah. Feel more snow with that. Yeah, he would have been dead. So after he sees this guy breathing, I mean, it's it's all good. Okay. You know, you right? like it's I'm good. okay. Yeah, he approaches it perfectly, right? Like an actual emergency okay. responder. He's like, "All right, you can breathe now. Now yeah. I'm gonna go." Let's slowly start getting you out. I'm gonna go get my shovel, and he has everything ready to go. Yeah, he's oh. prepared this year. Now, apparently, the snowboarder was with. Uh, other people, because if you're in this type of terrain, you got to be with other people. But sure. they had lost track of each other, uh -huh. and they they wouldn't have. I mean, you see the way that he was buried in there. It just so happened this guy with the second group, the guy on skis, is coming through the exact same area, and he catches it out the corner of his eye. The colorfulness of the snowboard poking out, but he could have just as easily had his head tilted slightly the other way and just skied right past, and and it's yeah, a done deal. Yeah. But he's not a done deal. And it ends on a bright note. Now, these guys are connected for life now at this point. Yeah, they actually became friends. And they meet up and talk on a regular basis now. Um, in this certain situation, they say that 90% of people who get stuck like this... No, people who get stuck like this, 90% chance you can't get yourself out. Somebody's saying, I, I, I've seen this on your show before. Definitely not. This was two weeks ago. I think one time we showed a guy in a crevice getting rescued by a helicopter. This uh -huh. is, uh, in this case, no one knew this guy was here. L like, look at him just buried in there. And it's just some incredible footage, yeah. which hope hopefully uh, acts as a lesson. Because I, I can't think of anything more compelling when it comes to taking your precautions when you're going into terrain like that. than You got to snowboard with people. Witnessing a clip like that. Yeah. Yeah. Harrowing stuff. Yeah, so absolutely wild, and GoPro loves it. I think they're the top comment on there. Yeah, yeah. Go, what an they incredible! I say, yeah, they like video right here. Get your GoPros going. Yeah. Uh, but still, yeah, this was this. This is a guy, a regular guy. This is just a guy's channel. He just uploads every so often some skiing stuff, and just happened into this moment, and all of a sudden now is doing all the types of news interviews and stuff. And there's actually a clip over there, yeah. ABC Eleven. Uh, or King Five Seattle, you can see uh, they meet up, have a beer afterwards. It's just crazy. He's the snowboarder on the right. It's here. just cr a crazy thought. Yeah, that you're sitting there. This guy saved your life, and you're 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 connected forever after that. Uh huh. In a weird way, in, in a good way, in a yeah. weird way. Yeah. Right? I mean, it's awesome. You love to see it work out. Hey, Nothing man. but awesome. Every so often, right? Why don't they? Why doesn't the algorithm give me things like this every so often? Uh huh. I guess it did in this case. Yeah.